Ric Flair currently training for in-ring return? Is Tessa Blanchard believed to be done with women of wrestling? Happy Friday, everyone. It's Denise Salcedo. I am back once again with another edition of the latest news and headlines in pro wrestling. Let's kick things off with Ric Flair returning to the ring. Dave Meltzer is reporting that Ric Flair, age 73 years old, is training to wrestle again for the first time since 2011. He said, quote, Ric Flair is training to wrestle again. The stories about his return are accurate. Flair hasn't wrestled since 2011 when Sting defeated Flair on an episode of Impact Wrestling. Although he did do matches during a Hulkamania tour in Australia and Impact Wrestling, his in-ring career largely ended in 2008 when Shawn Michaels defeated Flair at WrestleMania 24 in a retirement match. In recent weeks on social media, Flair has posted a video of himself training with AEW star Jay Lethal. Ric Flair left WWE in 2021 and made a few appearances post WWE, including a Triple A's Triple Mania event and NWA's 73rd anniversary last year. He has not made any high profile appearances since an episode of Dark Side of the Ring aired in September regarding the plane ride from hell incident where a flight attendant accused Ric Flair of sexual assault. Flair denied the allegations. What are your thoughts on a 73-year-old Ric Flair getting back to the ring? Let us know in the comments section below. Now, an update on Tessa Blanchard and WOW Women of Wrestling. In this week's Wrestling Observer Newsletter, Dave Meltzer confirmed reports from last week that Tessa Blanchard and Women of Wrestling have been at odds and that the belief is that she is no longer with the promotion. The former Impact World Champion was not at the show's first round of TV tapings last weekend as they returned after a long absence with a new syndication deal in tow. Meltzer said that the two sides had different ideas and were constantly butting heads. Fightful reported last week that there have been issues between both sides, partially related to a mid-April promo she cut on a wrestler named Samantha Sage Americana during a class. While the subject matter is unknown, they reported that many trainees spoke up about it and further promo classes were canceled. Tessa Blanchard has been in wrestling exile for the past two years after being released by Impact in what was a tumultuous 2020 that saw her accused of racism and bullying by other female wrestlers throughout the industry, claims which she has denied. The 26-year-old hasn't addressed the latest issue on Instagram where she is still active, well has also not released any statement. There you go, a quick roundup of the latest here on F4W Online. As always, do not forget to give this video a like, subscribe to F4W, and make sure to check out my show, Speak Now Pro Wrestling, live here Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Fridays. And if you guys want to come chat wrestling, you can hit me up on Twitter and or on Instagram at underscore Denise Salcedo. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.